With the marathon starting at 7 a.m. and construction blocking portions of the VVC, there are going to be questions about how and when to line up for the start of half the marathon. We hope this short video will help clear up any potential confusion. This aerial shot provides a nice overview of the starting area for the half. With the Von Braun Center on the right, we're able to see Clinton Avenue, Pollard Street, and Monroe Street. The starting line for the full marathon is on Monroe, off the screen to the right, as is Parking Garage M. Parking Lot K is off the screen on the lower left, and Parking Lot V is seen in the lower right. More about parking later. The marathoners will be running on the VBC side of Clinton, but the start line for half the marathon is on the far side, which is why it's important to view this entire video. As the full marathoners wind their way back to the halfway point beside the VBC, they will make a right-hand turn from Monroe onto Clinton, where they will immediately move left into the eastbound lanes closest to the VBC. We expect to see the lead runners between 8.10 and 8.20. Around 8.30, while the marathoners are running down Clinton, half marathoners will need to migrate toward the starting line. For those already in the arena, or those coming from a nearby parking garage, a clearly marked route will take you through the hallways of the VVC to the entrance slash exit of the North Hall. Runners parked in Lot V should also come to the North Hall entrance. Runners parked in Lot K? Hold on. We'll get to you in just a minute. While marathoners are racing by, half marathoners may want to gather in the North Hall hallway. Or, if the weather is warm enough, go outside and cheer for the marathoners. But, everyone needs to be careful not to cross in front of or interfere with those marathoners. To help ensure safety, there will be a guard at the crossing. A crossing guard, if you will. <laughs> the guard's responsibility is to watch for breaks in marathon traffic and usher half-marathoners to the far side of Clinton. Looking back at our aerial shot, the crossing point is here. When you do cross, make sure you stay in the far two lanes. The area east of Pollard, to the right in the picture, will be a staging or waiting area. This is important because Pollard will remain open until shortly before the start of the half. An HPD officer will be on duty directing traffic. A little before 9, the waiting will be over. Pollard will be closed and half marathoners will move forward to the start line. Remember when we told those parking in Lot K to hold on? Well, if you do park in Lot K, you may want to remain to the left or west of Pollard instead of entering the staging area. There will be a couple of porta potties available. When the half marathon starts, full marathoners will be running on the inside eastbound lane of Clinton. Those running half the marathon will run on the two outside westbound lanes parallel to the full marathon. The two races will merge at the left hand turn onto Seminole Drive and run together all the way to the finish line. 